Hey guys, I got some Halloween 3 news. Um, Patrick Lucier, or whatever his last name is, and Todd Farmer are beginning Halloween 3 right after they're done with Hellraiser Remake, which is in the works right now. So we'll be getting a Halloween film next year. I'm really excited because I loved Rob Zombie's first Halloween, and Rob Zombie's Halloween 2 was okay. Definitely was too dark and probably one of the least of my favorites in the Halloween series. But the great thing is I think Halloween 3 will be better because 1 is in 3D, so it's great to see Michael Myers in 3D. 2, they're going back to John Carpenter's original roots and 3 of the Keeping Rob Zombie style. And they're doing John Carpenter mixed together, which is a very smart and clever way because people love Rob Zombie's vision and people love the originals. So putting those two together will make it the perfect film and make a lot of money. And if it does well, I hope they make Halloween 4, 5, whatever. I don't care if it's a, re a remake of anything. As long as it's Halloween, I'm up for it. And it has Michael Myers in it, I'm up for it. You know? So hopefully you'll see him in the shadows and hopefully he'll get a new jumpsuit or mask or I don't know, something like that. Just bring him back to those original feel. And I think it's going to take place at the mental hospital. Because I remember reading an article once that the guy from Halloween 3, that main actor, he's going to be playing a Scout's psychiatrist. And it would be really cool to whole movie to take place in a mental hospital and he kills people in the hospital and like something happens where she tries to escape and the whole mental hospital explodes or just a big epicness towards the end or something like that. I think that's a direction that they're probably going to go for. If not, they could have her be, like, in the mental hospital. Then she gets out, and then she moves somewhere else, and then Michael's after her, and it's a big confrontation thing, like Halloween is I mean, it, it, I'm up for anything. As long as long, as long as it has good suspense, the Halloween themes throughout the film, and um, some good creative kills but no grunting, I'm good with it. I'm all up for it. You know, so I'm really excited to see what happens. So now we know Halloween 3 will be made and Scream 5. So we got two great movies looking forward to. And um, so I wanted to let you know I have a link of the interview of, interviews of the two um, guys who are making the movie. And they are talking about right after the Hellraiser reboot um, that they're making Halloween 3D. So I'm really excited. I think everyone's going to be excited. So we, we will be getting it next year. And um, I'm really excited. Thumbs up if you're excited. So, if you are excited for Halloween 3, thumbs up on my uh, video. If you're not, thumbs down. I don't care if you put thumbs down. If you're not excited, tell me why. If you are excited, tell me why. So that's basically my video. Are you excited for Halloween 3D or are you not excited? Me? I'm excited no matter what it is. It's a Halloween film. I was excited for Rob Zombie's Halloween 2. It may have been a disappointment, but it's still a Halloween film. And... You know, all of them are, are great to watch over and over again. So I'm really excited for Halloween 3 real soon. We get another Michael Myers film, which is awesome. Every time I, a Halloween film comes out, my, my stomach starts to get all, you know, like excitement. And I just start jumping up and down. When I saw Rob Zombie's tra first trailer for Halloween, I was like crying and screaming and jumping up and down because I was so excited. Like the music and... Michael Myers put the mask on again and everything. It just, I was so pumped for it and I loved the first movie. The first movie was awesome. And the second one was okay. Um, definitely was not my favorite, not everybody's favorite, but I am looking forward to Halloween 3 and I have a really good feel in my mind that it will be better than Halloween 2. Sorry, Rob Zombie, you are an incredible director with The Devil's Rejects and Halloween, but Halloween 2. I'm sorry, but I'm looking forward to your movie, Lord, Lord to Salem. <clears throat> I know you don't give a, a crap what people think, but look what happened. Halloween, Rob Zombie's Halloween made about 70 million something worldwide, the first one. And the second one went dropping down to 33. That's not a good, that's not a good thing. So hopefully they know what they're doing with the next movie and they will work hard and make sure that they will respect the Rob Zombie and the original Halloween fans and make it a great kick-ass movie. Alright, well that's my video and talk to you guys later. Bye.